Welcome back. This is Dan Havey with CF Ninja Hacks. And in this video, we're going to show how to put in a custom favicon for every single one of your funnel steps. As of right now, November of 2022, there is no ability to put in any kind of universal footer or tracking code for a funnel like there was in 1.0. So we are going to have to put this into every single page of the funnel, but at least it's a solution to be able to use a custom favicon for every single one of your funnel pages. So in general here, you can see where my favicon is set right there. And if I don't, if uh, let me see here, let's just go in and see where you would set that um, originally. I do believe we set that at the level of the site home page so we'll come in here to the site home page click on overview and then if we come here to site settings that's where you set your favicon for everything inside of this workspace but if we want to set it individually for a funnel let's just come into this uh, demo new funnel i have here and we're going to come to uh, a single page like i said there's no ability to put it in funnel wise wide you have to put it into every single page every single step whatever you want to call it so we're going to click here on edit and when we come into the page what we need to do is we need to open up the code editor at the bottom and we need to come down to the header code and we're going to paste in this code that i will drop below the video and then right here we have so it says link rel equals icon so that tells us that this is our favicon and that it is going to be an image and then right in here we got to drop in the address of the image we want to use as our favicon and so let's just come up here on the page let's find any image item let's open this up and let's go into where we have our image library and here i want to grab a hold of an image but if i right click here there's no way to copy the link for this image so you actually have to come in here and click on edit and then in here, if I right click on here, I can copy the image address. And if we want, we can drop this into our address bar up here. And you can see is this McDonald's logo that I'm going to use for this. So we're going to back out of here. We're going to go back into the custom code, back into the header code. And then we're just going to paste in that URL for that image. And then we're going to click on save. And now we're going to come out of here and we are going to reload this page. Now it may not kick in right away. In this case here, it did kick in right away. It could take a little bit for it to kick in, but uh, I've tested this a few times now and it seems to work just fine. So now if you want to put this into every other, uh, every other page in this funnel, we can come out of here. I copied as you saw. So I copied it from the one, came in here to the other, Drop in copy and boom and boom and we can save this and now let us uh, click on the little eyeball and let's see what we get and it doesn't want to stop spinning so I'm going to go to the live page let's see if we can get it to stop spinning there and when it was done loading up there we go we have the favicon on that page as well so that's it that's the simplest way as of today that you can get your own favicon onto every single one of your funnel pages so if you got any questions just let me know